Hello survivors and welcome to another Walking Dead Road to Survival video. In this video I'm going to be claiming Henjin from the museum, a name that I will forever butcher, and I think he's a good 6 star, that's why I'm claiming him, not just because I probably will want to make him an S class at some point, I think he's just a good 6 star. The crosshairs of his headhunter as a specialist skill is really really useful and he can definitely work in some teams. So what you might have noticed on the Michonne's Blessing Wheel is some of these boxes are kind of broken at the moment and this is because they haven't actually updated on the wheel. The boxes have been changed to from what they were before and they've been updated and you can see that on the roadmaps. So if we go to the S class roadmap you can see I'll just check the box and as you can see Henjin's item has been added to this box and that's what's happened to those boxes on the wheel and that's my guess why there's an issue and it's just not properly loaded for everybody if you do get one of those boxes just keep it in your inventory obviously you're not going to want to claim any of those items just hit x in the top right hand corner if you click claim by accident because it gives you a selection to choose just ignore it click x and basically you can wait and it should update in your inventory you know once they get to it basically it's also updated the upgraded version the torch version so you can get 130 vanilla cakes here and that's what i'm going to claim right now in my inventory i am pretty happy with this i'm not sure if i'm going to prioritize him really getting to s class i'm going to have to think about it but having him as a six star is great just because of like i said his headhunter and seemingly they're going to start bringing characters back um who are s class and be able to use velvet cakes with them it looks like prayer is coming back there is a little bit of a debate about how that's going to work in terms of is it six star prayer is it the s class does the s class work in that slot as well we'll have to find out once it drops now here's the box i'm going to claim my 130 vanilla cake slices and that should be it i should have a little thing pop up now the magic yes claim your rewards in the museum so we'll click this and as you can see i can claim him let's just go ahead Let's just go ahead. So it is my third, my third character from the museum. I have got Raulito as a six star maxed out and I now have got Henjin. I would say the way I'm doing it, it's probably not the best way to do things. I am gonna focus heavily on getting Priya from here. Basically anywhere, anywhere where Priya items are, I'm gonna grab them pretty much. Um, but I just wanted to pick up Henjin as a five star ascendable just to get him to six star because I do think he's useful. I'm not sure if he's actually got a weapon as a six star. He does, unfortunately, have an attached weapon. So you have to upgrade it. You can't just slot a weapon in his hands. I'm probably going to make him quite defensive with his mods. I might even make him defensive with his weapon and not even go for AP on attack. Just go for, you know, maybe defense just to make it so that he survives and he hits that headhunter because I don't think his damage output is going to be that great. 300% total is not that much damage. The bleed, however, is going to be nice, and he could work on one of my bleed teams, and a three-turn stun, he's going to be pretty fancy, I'm going to be honest. I kind of gave up my bleed team because I didn't really have the characters to deal with S-Class teams, but this guy can make the difference just because of that headhunter. So I thought I'd just show you that I'm the characters I claim. I'm going to do this going forward in terms of once I claim a character, I will show you that I'm claiming them, and I'm going to tell you why. Headhunter is going to be just great. Kills are going to be decapped. He'll work great on a bleed team, even as a six star, and it's slow progress, but he will eventually be an S class for me, but I don't think I'm gonna prioritize him. Do tell me, however, which character you're focusing on right now, if you're going for, like me, just going for the odd six star here and there because they're decent six stars, or you're going straight for an S class character, do tell me the character name in the comments and a reason why, if you have a specific reason why. That is the end of my video. Thank you very much for tuning in, and as always, keep on surviving, guys. Keep on surviving.